Hey, Lisa. Hey, Trisha and Lenore. I'm Lisa Chabilcock, 35-year resident of Naples, here on Mangrove Way and on a woods for 20. My husband and I discovered this 20 years ago and loved it here and knew it would be a great place to raise our two daughters, who are now grown and gone, but they come back and it's a lovely place to call home. Hi, my life in Naples, here with my husband Norman and our two girls, Jennifer and Emily, inspired me to write a children's books, one being about Naples. And is for Naples. It's a great book for kids. It follows the alphabet and two children who go through the exploits of what they can do in Naples from looking at birds, to picking fruit, to rocking in a hammock, to jumping into the Gulf. It's a great book. Kids love it. And on the heels of the success of this, I decided to write Ease for Everglades. And a lot of the background for both books came from years of volunteering in the schools and years of taking my daughters all over town. Um, the Everglades book I particularly enjoy because I spend a lot of time in the Everglades. So whether it's kids on an airboat ride, whether it's you know looking at deer, whether it's fishing, all the different types of fish, they're great, fun books. Again, following the exploits of the same two children through the alphabet. On the heels of those books, I wanted to try something a little different. I'm so inspired by the retirees in this town, in this neighborhood, that I did ours for retirement. And this is kind of a comical look at retirement. Um, for instance, one of the funny pages I happen to like is, T is for trophy wife, looking gorgeous by his side. She's 32, he's 95. The book has that kind of humor and I just, I think it's a great book. So that is my third book. So these are the books I'm very proud of, um, enjoy reading to groups around town. I'm in the schools a lot with them. So I hope you can see them someday. And if you see one in a store, grab a copy. I don't think you'll be disappointed. Hi, so if you see me out and about in paradise here, whether in town, in autumn woods, somewhere, please say hello, um, and I would love to chat.